that I obviously read. Uh, it was, I'm not going to, okay, but this is the last thing um, <laughs> that I'm going to give away. Uh, we don't actually have to tell about, talk about the story exactly because I do want people to be surprised when they download the book mm. and find the content because it was real value. Mm. But from my side, I think emotion, man. Like, that's such a powerful thing when it comes to marketing. Mm. Like, you need to trigger emotion. And there was a chapter, was it, uh, Are You Married? Mm. Um, where the guy asked the lady, what color eyes does your husband have? And I'm going to leave it there. Mm. But when I, I'm getting goosebumps right now. <laughs> and... Um, I thought about like, like, damn, emotion. Like, as I read that and, and I finished it, I was like, and you emotion. saw that happen. And I right? saw, saw that, that happen, happen in exactly. front of me, like I did. And I'm, look at that. Oh, you, you can see this goosebumps. Yeah. You can zoom in on this. Yeah. Um, so, that to me was really powerful. And emotion is such a big factor in making marketing more efficient. And that's technically what stories allow you to do, right? Like, what is your sentiment on emotion? And, mm. yeah, and I think. Look, I just want to point out there's a big there's a there's a big difference between persuasion and manipulation. Yeah, hundreds. Persuasion, I'm all for it, but the manipulation by its definition yeah. is trying to yeah. get people to do something that is evil. So persuasion, the uh, so well, not necessarily evil, but something that they don't want to do. Yeah, right. So, so if you want to read up more about persuasion, there's a guy called Robert Caldini. He wrote. Uh, I think the name of the book is Art of Persuasion. It's a very, very good book. And he talks about a few things. For example, one of them is uh, reciprocation, meaning that if I meet you for the first time and I bought you a coffee or I bought you a meal or I bought you a little gift, subconsciously you will want to give me something back in the, in the, in, in the, in the, in the long run. So reciprocation. And we see people do that like at events, they will give you some goodie bag and this and that, reciprocation. So you feel like, okay, maybe I would take their call or take that meeting. And it actually does work because I remember a few years ago at, at, at the, the company that I work, so we were thinking about different ideas of marketing and it worked like a freaking charm. The, the, the diaries, you know, the, the notebook. Shane, well, make notes. The, what we did was uh, we wrote out a whole lot of meaning like Dragon Slayer, um, high achiever, hardworking, never give up, grit, all these things printed on the page. And at the bottom it says, this is your story with your name, jean Grey de Beer, mm, as a gift. Mm, mm. Can I say, huh? so let me tell you something. When I was five, no, I was older than that, seven years old, one of uh, my aunts gave me a Power Rangers storybook. Okay. And in that book, was my name in the story. And you so felt what, like? And a hero, because I helped the Power Rangers defeat the evil There women. we go. I was, I'm getting goosebumps. <laughs> I love this stuff, man. So I was eight, seven, eight, and it was Christmas. I opened it up, and first of all, I was like, oh, man, like, what the hell is this? I don't want a book. Mm. Like, mm. who gives an eight-year-old? You want a toy. You want who, toy, who, yeah. who gives an eight-year-old kid a, a, book, a book for Christmas? Yeah. Mm. Like, are you trying to tell me something? <laughs> and I opened it up. And I was like, oh, sweet Power Rangers. Mm -hmm. And it's mostly graphics. I don't have to read everything. And then I saw my name. And that kind of like was like, whoa. But it was the best. I remember it. Till and the, you still remember I re still exactly, remember it. Exactly. Right? Exactly. And, I, exactly. And, I, and, I, and it was like 20 pages. Um, obviously, because I was eight. Yeah. And on top of that, like I remember it so clearly. Like Yandre and the Power Rangers. And uh, I remember literally at the end of the day, like I helped the Power Rangers defeat the evil villain. And that was my story. And I remember it till today. And it was so powerful. There we go.